Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 8 e-commerce tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about add subcategory on edit and add product page. So let's see how can we add subcategory on edit and add product page. You can see here, this is uh, add new product page and uh, here let's add the uh, subcategory option after this category. Okay, so for that, I'll switch to the project and let's open the add uh, product component class file. So just go inside the app directory, then HTTP, LiveWire, admin, and from here, let's open this one admin add product component class file. And inside this class file, uh, let's create a new property here. So just write here public and the property name which is subcategory, so write here is category underscore id ok now inside the render method uh, let's fetch here the subcategory according to this category id ok so right here dollar s categories is equal to subcategory where category id category underscore id is equal to dollar this arrow category id okay then call here get method now let's return this uh, s categories to the view file so here inside this array just write here comma then s categories arrow dollar s categories all right now let's open the admin add product component view file so just go inside the resources directory resources then views livewire admin and from here let's open this one admin add product component dot play dot php file okay and uh, inside this this file after this category uh, let's add here a select control for subcategory okay so let's copy this and uh, after this just paste here now change here the label so just write here subcategory and uh, also set here uh, change here the property name so just write here s category underscore id and now also inside the for each just write here s category s categories as s category and then s category id and here is category arrow name and also change here the uh, inside this validation just write here s category underscore id all right now go to the class file and uh, here let's create a function so right here public function and uh, function name change subcategory okay sub category and inside this simply write here dollar this arrow s category uh, s category id and uh, set here the default value zero okay and uh, inside this view file inside this option set here the value zero all right now let's copy this function name and uh, inside this uh, category uh, select control on the change action just call this function okay so right here wire colon change is equal to this function change subcategory okay in last uh, inside this add product method after this uh, category id let's add here first check here if dollar this arrow is category id okay then uh, just to store the s category id into the table okay so right here product 
एरो सब कैटेगरी कॉलम नेम सब कैटेगरी सो दैट इज सब कैटेगरी अंडरस्कोर आईडी इज इक्वल टू डॉलर दिस एरो इस कैटेगरी आईडी ऑलराइट नाउ इट्स डन सो सेव दिस फाइल एंड लेट्स चेक दिस सो स्विच टू द ब्राउज़र एंड जस्ट रिफ्रेश द पेज and here you can see the sub category select control okay by default is empty if i select here any category uh, let's select this one and uh, after this, this selection category selection you can see here in the sub category you can see the camera and television as a sub category okay so let's create a new product so i'm just going to write here the product name uh, new product let's say 111 okay and uh, add here the descriptions and here for here is the sort description okay sort description and here is the description description okay and regular price sale price sku stock in stock featured no quantity uh, let's say 10 and uh, set here the product image so select this one gallery image this one all right now select the category and now choose the sub category okay so for this time i'm just going to select this one okay you can create here the new category for this so now just click on submit and here you can see product has been sub created successfully okay now let's check the product inside this category okay so go to the shop page and uh, inside this category just click on this plus icon and uh, just open this sub category okay and uh, here you can see the product all right and if i click on this product you can see here the details of this product all right now let's uh, add the sub category option on edit product page okay so just click on all products now let's edit this product and uh, this time you can see here there is no any sub category option here so let's add here the sub category option here okay so for that switch to the project and uh, let's open the admin edit product component class file okay so from the app directory http library admin and uh, from here let's open this one admin edit product component dot php file now here let's uh, create a new property so right here public dollar s category id s uh, category underscore id okay and uh, now inside the mount method after this uh, just uh, get the value from the product table and assign to this property okay so right here dollar this arrow s category id is equal to dollar product arrow subcategory sub category underscore id okay and now uh, inside the render method let's fetch here the all sub categories according to the category id okay so right here s category categories is equal to sub category where where category id underscore id is equal to dollar this arrow category id okay and now for the other we get all right now let's return this so in 
inside this array and just write here comma s categories arrow dollar s categories all right and now let's uh, uh, create here the function same function so let's copy this one change subcategory so just copy and uh, paste here and uh, inside the save uh, this update product method after this this right here dollar uh, first add here the condition if dollar this arrow s category id then dollar product arrow sub category id sub this one just copy this line all right dollar product arrow sub category underscore id is equal to dollar this arrow s category id all right now let's copy this and uh, uh, copy this function name and go to the admin edit product component view file so from the resources directory just open this this one edit admin edit product component dot play dot php file okay and uh, inside this uh, first copy this so i'm just going to copy from here uh, this subcategory okay so just select this div and copy and uh, after this uh, select category option just paste here okay now inside this uh, select uh, control just add here the event wire call and change is equal to this function name so let's copy this function name and paste here all right now save this file now everything is done so Let's check this. So switch to the browser and just refresh the page. All right, you can see here the subcategory option here. If I edit the first product, this one, you can see here the category and this is the subcategory. Okay, if I change the category camera and uh, click on update, you can see here product has been updated and uh, if i check the this category so just open this one you can see this product in this camera subcategory okay so in this way you can you can add a subcategory option on edit and add product page so that's all about add subcategory on edit and add product page so thanks for watching this video and if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching